It's the kind of beat to go Hey guys, what's going on? It's Joey and we are here for Let's Play episode number 34. 34. So after actually looking through some of my other videos, I look, seems like I've already did 32 and 33. So I ended up doing those twice. Ugh, whatever. But it's all good, guys. So we are here for episode number 34, the legitimate continuation from for the Let's Play series. A little bit of a mistake there, but hey... 32 and 33 just got a little bit more special, but I thought the best thing to use for let's play number 34 would be to take a visit to the infected or the zombie side of the game. So it has been, it's been a while since we've actually attacked with them. It's been a good long time. I've got tons of brains. I've got a ton of DNA. I got about 152 coins, not too shabby, I must say. And I've got to be honest, I've missed them. I've always loved playing with the zombies. It's always been fun. A nice little break of nice and relaxing, you know, step back from the intense grind of the survivors but to take a look at my team here we got the harbinger we got the titan we got the puddler we have doctor or shaktor zambuats we have the spitter or the defiler we have the infector or the reanimator and of course another i believe that's a cesspool so one's the puddler one's a cesspool yeah all right it's coming back it's just been too long guys so of course I think one of the best things to do for a Let's Play episode is to just get some basic attacks in. And I think we're going to hit up PvP, which will take us to Havana. So, we're going to hit up Havana here. First off, let's go ahead and borrow. I mean, you know, I'm fine with that biohazard. I'm a fan of biohazards. So, we're going to be matched up against someone in the Bronze League here. We get 415 brains for a reward and 75 DNA. So, level 47. Bad kids. This is a level 50 player. This could be quite difficult, guys. So, where do I want to start this off? Gosh, I've missed this. The zombies are so much fun. All right, so I'm going to start off a group coming in right over here. Now, with that being said, it's going to be a nice little entry point for my drones here. And they're going to go ahead and attack that area, that building. I'm going to throw in a... Uh, where are you going, bro? Did not know where that guy was going. So we got do have plenty and plenty of drones here. I'm going to throw down a reanimator here to get me some more drones. And we do have a launching point for more drones as well. So I'm going to go ahead and throw those guys out here. Oh. Now, while that's going on, let me go ahead and throw another group here. Let me go ahead and let that guy over there, the Harbinger of Death, take out that wall there. And I'm going to throw a Titan up front to take some damage from that machine gunner that's going to run into. Throw another Titan in here right there. Oh, so much is going on. Biohazard is going to work on taking out those guys over there. Hopefully we can cause some damage to them, but slowly they go down and everybody is just wiped out on that end of the map. Oy vey. This is not looking good. Oh god. Save the day. Come on. Shocker Zomboids is going to have to like go off right now because I don't have any more drones. And that is a big part. No, my lord. I lost. You know what? I'm rusty, okay guys? It happens. You lose some. You win some. First attack back with the zombies was a complete failure. So... <laughs> Oh, that was not good. Fight. Here we go. We're making a we're making a big comeback here. All my guys are too low of a level. I need to upgrade them. Jeez, it's been too long. It's been too long. So, all right, dead shots right off the bat. I can easily take those guys out with just a large group of drones. Overwhelm them, no problemo. Now over here, we're gonna start getting a large group. So let me go ahead and get a pretty solid group of drones here. I'm gonna throw all my titans up front here. They're going to start taking some damage from those guys, but they just keep on taking it because they are just too good. So we got a good group of drones chilling in the back here. I'm going to throw two defilers to kind of help snipe out a little bit. So we are making our way slowly but surely through that wall. I got a group of drones as well heading towards the Stim Z factory. They're going to be able to take out no problem. I'm going to go ahead and throw a reanimator back here as well. Starting getting me some more drones just in case I do run out. Don't think I will, but it's always nice to have a couple of little backups. I'm going to throw in some behemoths right there just to start taking a ton of damage for me because those things are massive or they're colossus, but I believe they're behemoths. So I'm going to roll with behemoths. So they're going to go ahead and take on this wall here. Now, what we see here is Captain Zeta and a machine gunner. Mercenary. Mercenary. I take that back. But we're going to be able to overwhelm that. Those behemoths are just mammoths and they are just taking them out with no problem at all. We're going to make our way straight over to that hospital right there with no problems at all. And to finish it all off, Harbinger is going to take out that wall, and we are just going to cruise towards that machine gunner and blow it up. And that will finish it off, and we make a epic, epic, epic comeback from that last attack. That first one, complete failure. 
However, we made a sweet comeback, I must say. We did win. We got a pretty nice little payout there. Nothing too good, but I'll roll with it. I'll roll with it. So, Havana was a cons complete success. And we are just cruising. Now, I am in the Guild Zambas. They're level 25, and they are pretty darn good, I must say. I am impressed. Let's go ahead and check out the top player. How much Guild XP has he can... Oh, my lord. 701,000 Guild XP contributed. That is insane, and that is really cool to see that, because that just so shows how much dedication they have. So, PvP. Do we dare go for another attack, or do we take a visit to Shytown? You know what? Let's go take attack... Let's attack Shytown. Give it a little bit of comparative attack from the last one. Because we played, we attacked Chicago in the last Let's Play episode with the Survivors. So it, eh, it'll be nice to kind of see how it differs in terms of attacking strategy. I'm sure it won't be too much different. So let's see what we got here. We have some gunfighters. We have some lumberjacks. We got machine gunners. We have personal trainers and handyman outlaws possibly desperados we have just got a whole bunch of random stuff here so right off the bat here's what i'm gonna do i'm gonna draw a pretty substantial now of groups here drop that guy right over there the harbinger of death and he is just gonna take all of them out as you guys saw so we do have a small group of drones going right here now with them i'm gonna throw another harbinger what one more could it be and he just takes them all out. So we have that side of the map completely cleared out. Now what I'm going to do with the remainder of my guys here is we're going to start a solid group, substantially large here. I'm going to throw these two cesspools back here. And they're just going to start causing problems for those handymen. And we have one outlaw left to take out. I've got to be honest, guys. Doesn't stand a chance. So we're going to drop the remainder of my drones right on over here. And just in case, I'm going to have a reanimator kind of get me some more drones just in case they do end up taking out these guys. But I'm going to be honest, I'm feeling pretty confident about it. I'm going to throw two of my cesspools here as well to kind of start taking out. So hopefully we can snipe some of those guys over this wall. Cause some big problems for them. I'm going to stem them up, just get a little bit more juice there. Hopefully we can try to take out these lumberjacks, but it's not looking too good here. Now we are trying to take out those handymen right over here. They are taken down with success. These puddlers are still going hard. Let me go ahead and throw two defilers back here to help them out just a little bit. Come on, guys. Come on. We're going to throw a shock to zombie, which as well to give me a little bit more power juice. Come on. We are trying. We got one defiler left. He was managed to take out those guys, but Shakhtar Zombowitz is just wiping out all these guys. We managed to take out that last machine gunner. We are working our way through this bottle store with the drones, and we are looking pretty darn good. Looks like we got a little pesky human guys. I love those. Those guys are probably my favorite in the game. I've got to admit, oh, just a couple more, and that is it. We win it successfully. So that's pretty much Chicago. I like it. It's pretty darn good. You know, let's get one more attack in on Chicago, and we will call it a day. So, Chicago, 446 trophies. I'll take it. I will roll with that. Let me go ahead and continue here. World Zombination. The most epic. Whoa, that is weird. That was weird. If y'all saw that middle, it just randomly popped up. All right, event, Chicago. I think I'm going to have to swap out my team a little bit, so let me have that load. Change team. Take out my guys that are tired and throw in some more. I'm going to throw in my biohazard. And let's throw in the... Oh my gosh, we're running low on storage. Okay, this is going to be a power attack, guys. Except hard max units. Ah, clear them out, clear them out. Fight. This is going to be a power attack because we're running low on storage. That means we're running low on time. We got to make this quick, guys. Come on. This is going to be a crazy power round. We're just throwing out everything just because we have to win. We're going to overpower them no matter what because we just don't have a choice. So I'm going to throw half my guys over here. Half my guys over here. And I'm just going to start cruising with people. Shocker Zombwitch is going over there. Ah. Oh my gosh. Speed it up. We are like going crazy right now just because I can't afford to lose. Ooh, I got a drone. There we go. This isn't getting intense, guys. We're making our way. We are cruising. As you can see, we are just loading them up with extra strength. Ox antioxidant power. We just cleared that out really quick. That's how you do it, guys. You just throw down everything and hope for the best. But guys, thank you so much for watching. I do hope you enjoyed this video immensely. Remember, if you like the video, slap a like on that. 
Give it a thumbs up if you enjoyed it as well. Make sure to subscribe and always comment because I like you guys to comment. It's always great, guys. Love talking to you guys. Thank you so much for watching, and I will see you guys in the next video. See you guys.